Welcome. I'm glad to see so many faces here. We have lately worked hard at Insplorion to be able to deliver this. Insplorion Aculite. It is a combination of acoustic and light. It is a tool where we are combining the quartz crystal microbalance with our nanoplasmonic sensing. So what we have here and what we are going to show you is how we are combining the QSense Explorer Analyzer with our Insplorion X-Nano tool. And this is what it looks like. So basically what we have here is our optical tool uh, adapting on top of uh, the uh, QSense uh, system. Uh, Aculite also means companion and it's basically the companion between uh, the acoustic technology and the light technology. But it's also the companion between the company's QSense uh, uh, and Insplorion. And it's of course your best research companion from here on. So basically what we have done is taking our technology where we're using uh, an optical uh, probe that basically goes in a reflective, re reflective mode setting um, and on top of the uh, ordinary quartz crystal microbalance sensor is where we have our uh, NPS disks, our gold nano disks. And thanks to doing this simultaneously, we now can work with uh, all uh, or all three parameters simultaneously. The, uh, the acoustic frequency anticipation as well as our optical uh, LSPR signals output. It's all about the sensor. And this is basically what it looks like. Uh, with a somewhat different color for you who are used to, to this one. And the advantages are to some of you obvious. Uh, you have all ha been frustrated when you have do done two experiments and you're not really sure of, did I have the same surface? Did I have the same flow profile? Did I have the same chemistry? Why doesn't it look the same? Now, when doing it all at once, uh, we can be much more confident th that, uh, that it works and, and that it's the same. It's also uh, uh, that we get different type of information from our two tools. We get different type of mass and we also have different type of sensing depth uh, when we look at our, non uh, at our structures. In short, uh, our technology, the nanoplasmonic sensing gives dry mass, the quartz crystal microbalance gives wet mass, Together with the Aculite, we now can calculate and get out the dry and wet mass. So for thin films, uh, we can basically understand much more about uh, organization and conformational uh, changes. When, for instance, looking at protein films uh, and trying to understand how much water do we have in, in the uh, system and how does, what happens when we adsorb an analyte. Uh, also, when it comes to uh, thicker coatings, we basically can start to do depth profiling and understand our polymers or our uh, material for solar cells much better. But you shouldn't trust me on this. You should listen to what some of our customers and users have, have done. So uh, recently we tried the combination between the QCM instrument and the Explorion uh, instrument and what we found was that uh, we can get nice information from both instruments. First of all, the QCM gives us um, an idea about the mass of molecules loaded in our host structure, while the exploring instruments give us information about the diffusivity of molecules through our host structure, and therefore the combination of both um, is um, a good combination and we can get complementary information about um, yeah, molecules diffusing through our porous host structure on the substrates. Uh, so I've been using the combined NPS with the QCM setup. What we are trying to do is we want to quantify the absorption of hydrogens into the palladium gold alloy. So why do we need this uh, combination? Because of course with the NPS uh, it's difficult or even impossible to quantify the amount of the hydrogen. But then just using QCM alone, 
uh, you don't have information of the intrinsic of the materials when they are absorbing hydrogen. So we believe that the method that we are doing now, combining the LSPR and uh, QCM, will really give uh, a lot of insights about how the hydrogen is absorbed and form the hydride into the palladium growth alloy. So it's really an uh, interesting and exciting way to start this project. And I also would like to um, uh, repeat the quote from Johan Westman at uh, Bailin Scientific, who has the QSense instruments. The Explorion Acolyte is based on an exciting technology. It complements our QSense offering and further expands the range of powerful surface analysis options available to our customers. So, with that, I hope for good questions. How many of your existing uh, customers are interested in this? Existing customers, uh, looking at our own customer base uh, of, of the 10 customers that we have out there, about uh, it's, it's seven that has access and use the QSense systems. So that's one of the reasons why we decided to do this, uh, that we basically see uh, the need of the combination tool from our existing uh, customers. And it's also about uh, 500 to 700 QSense instruments out there where this uh, add-on uh, from us now can fit quite well. Yes? Uh, how do you plan on distributing the product? Distribution, um, that's also one of the benefits uh, actually uh, due to that uh, four of our seven distributors already distribute the QSense instrument. So it's, it's a good fit in, in the sales lines in that way. More questions? Thank you very much. Have a look at the brochure.